know, I play with Nick in the top 100 camp, and I play against him at AU. So, you know, we've been knowing each other for a long time. So, he's a great player. You know, uh, he plays hard. And, you know, it's going to be a fun battle tomorrow. Um, I was talking to Sabian. He said that the SMU game was kind of that, that moment of buying, I guess, with this team. So, with uh, coaches' philosophy and stuff, yeah. tell me what kind of the buy-in is, what all this buying in involved here? You got to stay with each other, stay locked in at all times, you know, you got to have belief, uh, you know, with everything, when the team going to run, you can't get down on each other, you know, so we just stay locked in at all times, that's what Coach saying. And then as a team, how do y'all handle um, a game like this, like not allowing it to be too big of a moment with I Kentucky mean, primetime in the atmosphere? You got to move on, you know, after a big win, you got to grow up, you know, we got a big win on the road, we needed that win. And, you know, they're sophomores now, it's second semester, so they're basically going to their sophomore year. So, you know, they know what to expect when playing big teams now. What does Kentucky bring as far as the difference between them and Memphis? Are they a little bit bigger in the paint then, Ray? Uh, I really don't know. You know, I really don't pay attention to things like that until we get the scout reports and stuff like that. Uh, but they're a great team. You know, I played I played against them the last two years. You know, they're, they're physical. You know, they crash the board and things like that. So you got to be ready for it. What about just your performance? I mean, last year you always say there was there was always Nick. If you got in trouble, there was always Clax. And now it's kind of like if Ray goes down, uh-oh. Yeah. Do you feel that pressure on your shoulders every uh, outing? Always. You know, uh, my team, you know, they believe in me and I believe in them. You know, but it ain't always about me. It's always about the other player. You know, Ant, Tyree, Saber. You know, when they get hot, it makes it easier for everybody on the team. So you would love to have that on your team. And just handling the moment. I mean, yeah. you hit that big three. Uh, playing on that stage. I yeah. mean, can you just explain what's going through your mind, your body in that moment? Uh, it was another day in the gym for me. You know, I work on that shot every day. Uh, I've been playing a lot of big games my whole career, so it wasn't nothing crazy or nothing like that. It was a big shot to get the win, really, for me. Obviously, the win Saturday was big for a confidence booster, but you know, how much do you think tomorrow night is about you know showing that that wasn't a fluke and that yeah. you know Georgia basketball is here? Uh, only thing I can say, you know, we just gotta you know we gotta be ready for it. You know, uh, you just gotta grow up and be ready for big games after a big game. You know, you are gonna play them every day in the SEC, so you just gotta be ready for them.